find the dimensions of the rectangle if its perimeter is 52 inches. W plus 9 and W is what's given. How do we find our given dimensions? All right, let's do it. We're going to use a little bit of math. And we're going to get this done. So first thing I need you to understand is we're going to write an equation out. So we're going to write an equation that's saying equal to 52 representing the perimeter. Well, what do we know about the perimeter? We know that it is adding everything on the outside. So W plus 9 plus W, that's got to be W plus 9, and that's a W. So now that we have everything out there, we can just add all of that up, combine it, get the sum, and say that it has to equal 52 inches. So I got one, two, three, four W's. Those are my like terms right there. So we're going to say four W plus, I have this nine and this nine, which is going to combine to give me a total of 18. And we know that that has to equal 52 inches. Remember, everything added together is my perimeter. So this is a simple two-step equation now to solve that we've set up. And what it's going to do is it's going to give us our value for W. All right, well, take away 18, cancels, take away 18. 34 equals 4W. Now we need to divide by 4. Opposite of multiplying is dividing. Cancels it out, divide by 4. W equals 34 divided by 4. We're going to get decimal 8.5 or 8.5. Okay. Well, I know that this side right here of the rectangle, since it's only W, I know that that's eight and a half inches. But this is where kids make mistakes, okay? They stop right here, they say, found W, boom, done. You can't catch me teach, that's it, I'm done. No, you're not, you need the dimensions, plural, dimensions. I need to know what this side length is. And that is W plus 9, meaning the value of W, 8.5 plus 9 for a grand total of uh, 17 and a half inches. You need to give both of the dimensions for this question. Hopefully this makes sense. Study hard and good luck on your upcoming test.